Archaeological Paths presents to you day-by-day -day videos that were recorded during one of the Turkey Royal Tours. Now, you can also join this incredible 14-day journey to discover the archaeology, history, culture, and natural beauty of this amazing country that is rightfully referred to as the Cradle of Civilization. Welcome to Ephesus. Right now we are in the one of the most important ancient cities that was ever built. The center and city was built by wealthy Romans and it has its own harbor and it's near a beautiful river. And it was not only the cultural center of the world at one time, but also a place very important to Christianity. According to the New Testament, St. Paul lived in Ephesus, preached here for the time. Since that time, this is a very important place for Christians. Today we had a unique opportunity to ride on the Dylan River. At the moment we are in Kaunas, one of the cities with the rock cut tombs that are an iconic side of Turkey, date back even till 9th centuries BC. However, the city itself dates back till 4th century BC. In Turkey, of course, there are many fascinating and well-preserved archaeological sites. Kaunas is a one-of-a-kind place in many regards. In spite of its great interest, the site has not yet become a household name on the list of dream destinations for aspiring cultural travelers, except for those familiar with its region. I have very close and trusted friends, who's, who I trust and whose taste I trust, who went on one of the archaeological paths, tours of Egypt. And they were not merely pleased, they were raving about, uh, he was, he, he just said, we saw things I know we would not have seen, and I think they're right. You know, I, it's, it's, it's hard to single out a single thing, but the care, the preparation, and also the uh, sort of fleet of footness of, of Sawat about, uh, for instance, yesterday, we'd been running a little late, I could see him looking at his watch, and he quickly lined up that tractor-driven, very nice little uh, <laughs> cart that, that took us up the hill at, at Konos, uh, which was just, you know, just it just happened and it was, it was, uh, it made the schedule a little more spacious and it, may, it gave us a little more energy. 